The key to ultrasound guided synthesis is to align the needle in the same plane as the ultrasound beam. Take a close look at this diagram from Edinger to understand how to visualize the plane of the ultrasound beam. You will notice that the ultrasound probe has a small dot on one side. This can be located on the ultrasound screen to help orient right versus left. I prefer to keep the dot on the left. As you can see in the next diagram, if the needle is advanced outside of this plane or on an angle, you will not be able to visualize the tip of the needle. In this diagram, the white portion of the needle represents that which transects the path of the scanning plane and is therefore visualized. For routine diagnostic synthesis, an appropriate size needle and syringe is adequate. Advanced smoothly and deliberately. It is recommended to switch the needle to a sterile needle before injecting the sample into a urine collection container to minimize the risk of contamination. For decompressive synthesis, which is most often used in the blocked cat, to alleviate the pressure within a maximally distended bladder, I prefer either a butterfly catheter or an extension set so that the setup is a little bit less rigid. It is important to not advance too forcefully or quickly because that can lead to urinary bladder rupture.